is it. The new Babyface Pro, machine from a block of aluminum, very solid, very stable, very sturdy, with uh, everything made new. This is not an update of the old Babyface, it's a complete new Babyface. That's, you will see, I will show you the details now why we call it really Pro and we think it deserves the name. It's first not only the housing and the improved display operation by four buttons here, but also no breakout cable anymore. The biggest complaint of most of the customers. These XLR uh, sockets are put directly into the housing. It's a special new design which allowed us to make it more slim. Yeah? They are also with professional level, plus 19 dBU. Also, the unit is only running on 5 volt from USB, but we do that. On this side, you see two more inputs. That means the new Babyface has four analog inputs now. These are high impedance TS jacks. Um, you can connect everything, line, guitar, bass, keyboard, no problem. And you see two headphone outputs. They carry the same signal, but they have different electric drivers. These are the outputs 3.4, analog output 3.4. Um, the small one is optimized for low impedance headphones, which are very popular today thanks to smartphones. Uh, and the other one is for the most, more older cans. Um, this one is optimized with 6 dB more level. So it should be quite nice listening experience with this unit. We will have one MIDI breakout cable included. This is just one MIDI I.O. Um, you can use the you stand alone with nearly every functionality. Uh, this one is lockable. So we have a special power supply that you can order from the Mati 6T where we used that before. Uh, put it in, turn around and fixed. Yeah. You also get this special 90 degree angled USB cable which fits into the housing very firmly. It's a special construction. There's no shaking, it's not loose. But this uh, socket is universal, of course. You can put in every cable. But this one is included. So on the bottom, we added a small thread for standard microphone stands. So you can put it up on the microphone stand and operate it here, somewhere. So the Wayfist Pro comes, like I said, everything new. That means we have new ADDA converters inside. We have uh, lower THD. We have better signal-to-noise ratio. We have much better frequency response. Uh, that is quite amazing difference. Um, the headphone is 60 dB more loud than in the old baby face. Um, uh, the operating here is uh, very clearly and simple. Just have an example. You change here on the button out between all the outputs and then you adjust the level. Your output volume level. Yeah. On this button, you step through the inputs and then you select left, right, or both, and then you adjust the gain, in this case from the microphone inputs. You see we show the gain and the uh, volume of the audio signal at the same time, which is quite nice because if you turn up the gain, you will notice when you run into overload quickly. Now, let's say we have channel 1, 2 here on the input and channel 3, 4 on the output. Now you want to have monitoring. Also, this is possible now. You just click the mix button and you turn up left or right channel and you get monitoring. This is, of course, the same functionality you see here in Total Mix. If we, I can show this here. We control the input fader. The current submix output is the main out. And now if you look here, I change to 1, 2. Hit the mix button and it will jump. Whoop. And again, I can turn the fader and now route the monitoring here. The point is that all this mixing is now available standalone because if you have no USB connection, you can still use it, adjust it, and uh, work with it.